Okay, now I invite uh, Dr. Parvez Masood. He is from IGNO. Uh, he will have some. Yeah. Uh, no, I am at the moment from Pune. Uh, yeah, I am from Delhi. I was there. I think. Honorable Sudhendra Kulkarni ji. I usually see him on the television. I am seeing for the first time face to face. <laughs> yeah. I am <coughs> Ma'am Gafar or Ashraf Bhai. <coughs> Here I am going to represent the <laughs> Government of India the Indira Gandhi National Open University. We are working for the dis disadvantaged sections of society. You know that uh, the need of the country, the requirement of, I mean, to educate the people of India, we do not have those many universities and colleges. Uh, many people due to, you know, social, economical reason, they had to quit education. There are people in the remote and village, I mean remote areas, villages or community like this, you know, there are inhibition, they don't allow the children to go around. Here, this Indira Gandhi Open University is an answer for all such things. We are working, we have 3.5 million students in India. They're all this kind of people. Of course, the young students, they go to the college, they go to the universities. There are many, you know, who are employed in service due to, I mean, I told you, social and uh, economical reason they don't go. Indira Gandhi National University is helping them. They are teachers. We are training teachers because they cannot go to a regular school. They are already working somewhere. But this is the thing, you know, we are exiting all facilities. We are establishing study centers all around. We have special study centers for disadvantaged sections of society. For the rural women and minorities, also we have centers. Under the, uh, I mean, Sachar Commission, we have economically and backward blo blocks that, that have been identified by uh, Sachar Commission. We are establishing studies. We have many. We have many. The government of India is trying to help. We are to take help from the government of India. You can institution. Of course, uh, I met people. They're all from the schools. Yes, uh, primary school. But this is in university. But we have one very good scheme that is called the Bachelor's Preparatory Program, BPP. That's what we call them, because somebody uh, who did not study, did you know, to turn twelve, they had to leave the school in between. So when they have grown up. So one has to be eighteen years of age. That person, lady ho ya gents, ladka ho ya ladki kind of thing, they, if they are uh, 18 years of age, wo BPP ka sakte hain. This is, a, uh, this is not equivalent to 10 plus 2, it is a simply a bridge course. That is, after completion of the bachelor's preparatory program, those students can get enrolled into IGNO's BA program. Because this is not acceptable anywhere. It is a sort of, we prepare them to our graduate program, BA, BCom, Bachelor's of Tourism Studies, Bachelor of Social Work. We have so many graduate programs in which they can be. There are thousands of them. We could train, we could bring them into the mainstream. We extended, you know, we, uh, I mean, provided, provided them access to education. After completion of the BPP, they come, they came here, they did the graduation, post-graduation, they are doing PhD studies. Many of them are IS officers. Many of them, you know, recently, uh, I mean, uh, from Bihar, you know, two students who were uh, working uh, in, maybe, uh, in shops, maybe some like. So after they joined BSc, uh, the BPP, they did BA, then took, uh, you know, job in railways. They were reservation clerk somewhere. So they prepared on the basis of IGNU, BA, and they are IS office now. <laughs> So this is the strength. This is the strength the Indira Gandhi National University has to help the people. But the only thing is we need to I mean, I'm traveling, you know, uh, with uh, Ma'am Ghaffar all the way. I mean, telling people, our community, that this is the use of this. Because, uh, I mean, there are other things also. I mean, wherever we go, many institutions uh, ask us what we will get. 
आपको कुछ नहीं है आपको तो सवाब ही मिलेगा यस सी इन दिस इज द यूनिवर्सिटी हेल्प एवरी थिंग यू नो राइट फ्रॉम स्टार्टिंग यू शुड हैव एन एजुकेशनल इंस्टीट्यूशन that should be you having uh, i mean uh, teachers with everything right from establishment of a study center to the teaching you know to um, payment to the teachers the counselors we call them the study material and the fees of the gandhi open city the courses is bahut kam is nothing is nothing ye sath hai isliye sab logon se guzarish hai ki aap indira gandhi national university jo central university hai under ministry of mhrd main delhi ka director raha jahan madam se mila tha now i have come to maharashtra um, before this i was in madhya pradesh madhya pradesh mein maine bahut kaam kiya hai ab pune aaye hain maharashtra hai mere colleague hain dr vardhan we have regional office uh, in mumbai also in mulun so we have you know circulated the prospectus so anybody i mean i know people who are i mean service karne ke motto se aaye hain something like that they are मैं वर्किंग टू वर्ड ए प्राइमरी स्कूल एजुकेशन जो आपके बच्चे हैं बच्चियाँ हैं दे वॉन्ट टू गो यू नो टू हायर एजुकेशन प्लीज टेल दम टू बिग्नो लेक दम टेक बेनिफिट ऑफ इंदिरा गांधी ओपन यूनिवर्सिटीज द फ्लेक्सीबल एजुकेशन द क्वालिटी एजुकेशन एंड द यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ इंटरनेशनल स्टैंडर्ड बहुत बहुत शुक्रिया आपको बहुत खुशी हुई आप लोगों से मिल के मैम ने मौका दिया आप सब लोगों को बहुत बहुत शुक्रिया थैंक यू सो मच